Free video conferencing tools enhance remote team collaboration by enabling real-time communication, fostering engagement, and improving overall productivity through features like screen sharing and recording capabilities. We tested many apps and found the 10 best ones that greatly helped us. We use these apps in our office to automate all the meeting schedule with remote teams. As a result, our workflow has become much faster. Today, we'll share these apps with you so you can also benefit from them. So let's get started. First up is Zoho Meeting, which we found to be a reliable tool for video conferencing and webinars. It allowed us to schedule and manage meetings effortlessly, and we could even host department-specific sessions. The recording feature was useful, as we could replay and share meeting content with team members who missed the live session. Using the platform, we hosted several live webinars, complete with real-time polls and question-and-answer sessions. This interactive element significantly improves participant engagement. The ability to live stream webinars to YouTube expanded our reach and connected us with a broader audience. For internal meetings, the screen sharing and whiteboard features were invaluable for collaboration. We could easily present ideas and gather feedback, which enhanced our team's productivity. Additionally, the option to manage business phone calls and SMS from within the app streamlined our communication processes. Overall, Zoho meetings suited our needs well and would be an excellent choice for organizations looking to enhance their remote collaboration capabilities. Next up is Microsoft Teams, a helpful tool for video conferencing that we utilized for our remote meetings. It provided features like screen sharing, live captions, and customized backgrounds which made our sessions more interactive and engaging. The platform's ability to hold virtual events for up to 1,000 attendees, as well as webinars and broadcasts for up to 10,000, was impressive. We found the recording feature beneficial, which allowed us to capture and review meetings for those who couldn't attend live. The raise hand and chat functions enabled smooth communication and kept our meetings organized. Speaker Coach offered real-time feedback, which helped improve our presentation skills. Using the app, we managed to host meetings with ease, mute background noise, and even remove uninvited attendees. It supported collaboration by letting us visually brainstorm and work together on presentations in real time. Overall, this tool was effective for maintaining productivity and connectivity within our team. We recommend it for businesses and organizations looking to enhance their remote work setup. Upcoming is Dialpad. We've used its free AI-powered video conferencing tool a lot and found it quite practical for our remote work needs. The platform allows unlimited video meetings, which we found valuable for both team collaborations and client interactions. One of the main benefits is its flexibility across devices. Whether we were on a Mac, PC, iOS, or Android device, joining a meeting was easy. This proved essential for our hybrid work setup which allowed participants to connect easily, regardless of their location or device. Dialpad's meeting controls were another highlight. We appreciated the ability to manage video and microphone settings, which helped us accommodate different comfort levels and technical issues. Additionally, screen sharing was easy. We could share our screen, a specific window, or a document, and invite guests to view via a simple web link, which reduced the need for them to download any app. Security features like muting participants and managing screen sharing gave us peace of mind. With encryption and easy user management, we recommend Dialpad to any organization or business seeking a reliable and user-friendly video conferencing solution. Moving on to Zoom. We used its free video conferencing tools for our remote team meetings. It offered unlimited video meetings, which was perfect for our frequent check-ins and client discussions. The cross-device compatibility stood out, which let us join meetings from Macs, PCs, iOS, and Android devices. This flexibility ensured that everyone could participate, no matter where they were or what device they had. We appreciated the advanced meeting controls, 
The option to mute participants or manage screen sharing helped maintain order during larger meetings. The screen sharing feature was smooth, which allowed us to share our entire screen or specific documents. Sending a link for guests to join without downloading anything was convenient, particularly for clients. Security was another crucial aspect. Hosts could mute participants, limit screen sharing, and manage guests, which ensured a secure meeting environment. Overall, Zoom's ease of use and security features made it a reliable choice for us. We recommend this tool to any organization or business looking for a dependable video conferencing solution for remote teams. The next lineup is TrueConf. We used its free video conferencing software, which supported up to 50 users. This was ideal for our team meetings, which provides secure and encrypted communications that ensured our conversations remained private. The platform provided 4K video quality, which made our discussions clear and professional. Setting up was straightforward, and it worked smoothly on Windows, Mac OS, Linux, iOS, and Android. This versatility allowed everyone to join meetings from their preferred devices. We appreciated the team messaging feature, which kept our discussions organized before, during, and after meetings. The advanced meeting management tools allowed us to schedule and record meetings, which helped us keep track of important decisions. TrueConf also allowed one SIP by H323 connection and one guest connection, which made it easy to include external participants when needed. Its offline operation in LAN and VPN ensured our meetings ran smoothly, even without a stable internet connection. Overall, this tool was effective for our remote collaboration. We recommend it to small teams or businesses requiring a reliable, secure video conferencing solution. So now we have free conference. We used its free video conferencing service, which supported up to 100 participants. This was perfect for our remote team meetings. The setup was simple and we were able to host and join calls without requiring credit cards or dealing with hidden fees. We liked the HD quality video and audio, which made our discussions clear. One feature we found useful was screen sharing. It allowed us to share presentations and documents directly from our browsers without needing downloads. Scheduling meetings was easy and we could send invitations and reminders to keep everyone on track. We also utilized the meeting room for webinars and presentations finding it effective for both internal and client-facing meetings. Another benefit was the secure encrypted communication. We felt confident that our conversations remained private. Recording meetings was great. We just hit the record button on the toolbar or used a simple phone command. This helped us keep detailed records of our discussions. Overall, this tool worked well for us. We recommend it to small teams and businesses looking for a reliable and easy to use video conferencing solution. The next lineup is Slack. We used it for our remote team communication and found it highly effective. It allowed us to chat, send audio and video clips, and join huddles for live discussions. This flexibility helped us stay connected, regardless of time zones or locations. The channels feature was particularly useful. We organized our workspaces into channels dedicated to different projects and departments. This made it easier to share information and collaborate with team members. We also appreciated the ability to integrate various apps within our channels, which improved our workflow. Slack's security measures were reassuring. Knowing our data was encrypted and protected allowed us to focus on our work without worrying about privacy issues. The ability to record conversations and access them later was another handy feature, which helped us keep detailed records of important discussions. Overall, we found this tool to be a nice solution for team communication and collaboration. We recommend it to any organization or business looking for an efficient and secure way to stay connected. Here is Livestorm. We tried it for our virtual meetings and found it to be quite effective. It allowed us to host webinars, automate them, and even run on-demand sessions. This flexibility enabled our team to stay connected and productive no matter where we were. One of the standout features was the ability to scale our virtual events. We could easily accommodate many participants, which was perfect for our internal and external meetings. Additionally, the tool offered various engagement features like polls, Q&A sessions, and chat, which made our webinars more interactive and engaging. We also appreciated the customization options. 
It allowed us to personalize the branding of our events, making them look more professional and aligned with our company's identity. The data analytics provided insights into participant engagement, which helped us improve future sessions. Using this tool improved our virtual communication and event management. Its simplicity and powerful features made it an essential part of our remote work toolkit. We recommend it to any organization looking for a reliable video conferencing solution. Let's shift our focus to Jitsi Meet. We used it for a lot of our remote team meetings and found it highly effective. It's an open source, fully encrypted video conferencing solution, which made our sessions secure and private. We appreciated not needing an account to use it, which made it quick and hassle-free to set up meetings. We shared our desktops, presentations, and even collaborated on documents using the integrated Etherpad feature. The ability to invite users via custom URLs added a personal touch to each meeting. Additionally, the chat feature allowed us to trade messages and emojis, enhancing our communication during video calls. One standout benefit was the HD audio which provided crystal clear sound quality, crucial for productive discussions. Knowing that our conversations were encrypted by default added an extra layer of security, which helped us set our minds at ease. The open source nature meant we could modify and customize it to fit our specific needs, which made it a flexible tool for our team. This app improved our remote collaboration significantly. We recommend it to any organization looking for a reliable, secure, and user-friendly video conferencing tool. Last up is Ring Central Video. We relied on it for our remote team meetings and found it quite useful. This app offered AI-powered live transcription and post-meeting summaries, which made our note-taking process much more efficient. We hosted meetings without needing downloads, joining via desktop or mobile browsers. We utilized the interactive whiteboarding feature for brainstorming sessions, which allowed us to collaborate effectively in real time. The ability to switch between desktop and mobile devices with one click added great flexibility to our workflow. Additionally, the dynamic end-to-end -end encryption and waiting rooms ensured our meetings remained secure. The AI-powered transcription feature helped us include everyone in the conversation, which enhanced our communication. We also benefited from the noise removal settings, which maintained professional audio quality during calls. These features saved us time and increased productivity, both during and after meetings. For any organization looking for a user-friendly, secure, and feature-rich video conferencing tool, this app is a great choice. So those are our takes on the best video conferencing tools, each with its unique benefits and features. We hope this video gives you a good idea of the possibilities and helps you make the right choice for your needs. Let us know if you have any further questions or would like to share your thoughts in the comments below.